Is it time to buy or sell NEO stock? In this video, we're diving deep into NEO. Our initial report was published on our website on Wednesday, September 13, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Remember to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. You don't want to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Enhance your trading decisions by trying our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and get a free price predictions and deep analysis for anyone among 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. Since September 11, 2023, our system has ranked NEO as a strong sell candidate, giving it a score of minus 5.12. Let's take a look at the stock's performance during this period. The stock experienced a loss of minus 2.52%. This translates to an average loss of minus 0.84% per day since it was listed as strong sell candidate. The stock lies in the lower part of a very wide and strong rising trend in the short term, and this may normally pose a very good buying opportunity. If the lower trend floor at $10.05 is broken, it will firstly indicate a slower rate of rising, but may also be an early warning for a trend shift. The current 3-month trend suggests a potential 12.87% change over the next 3 months, with a possible return between 12.63% and 82.69%. As for the 12-month trend, it suggests a minus 19.44% change over the next 12 months, with a potential return between minus 49.21% and 20.42%. This translates to a price range of $5.11 to $12.13 after a year. Our latest daily update for NEO includes the headline, NEO stock downgraded to strong sell candidate. The NEO stock price fell by minus 4.73% on the last day, Wednesday, September 13, 2023, from $10.57 to $10.07. During the last trading day the stock fluctuated 4.08% from a day low at $10.06 to a day high of $10.47. The price has fallen in 7 of the last 10 days and is down by minus 7.53% for this period. Volume fell on the last day along with the stock which is actually a good sign as volume should follow the stock. On the last day, the trading volume fell by minus 1 million shares and in total, 37 million shares were bought and sold for approximately $369.47 million. Over the past 52 weeks, the highest price of stock was $22.74, and the lowest price was $7. Currently, the price is 55.72%, or $12.67, below the 52-week high, and 84.97%, or $56.92, below the all-time high on January 11, 2021, when the price reached $66.99. Analyst Ratings On Monday, June 12, 2023, it was reported that UBS gave NEO a neutral grade with a hold action. On Monday, June 12, 2023, it was reported that Citigroup gave NEO a buy grade with a hold action. On Tuesday, March 14, 2023, it was reported that JP Morgan gave NEO a neutral grade with a downgrade action. On Thursday, March 2, 2023, it was reported that Telsey Advisory gave NEO a neutral grade with a downgrade action. On Thursday, December 29, 2022, it was reported that Citigroup gave NEO a hold grade with a hold action. Analysts have given NEO stock a general buy rating. They rate the PE ratio as strong buy and price to book as strong buy. For return on investment, the analysts give the stock a neutral rating. The following signals have been identified for NEO. Furthermore, there is a buy signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. Some negative signals were issued as well, and these may have some influence on the near short-term development. The NEO stock holds sell signals from both short and long-term moving averages giving a more negative forecast for the stock. 
Also, there is a general sell signal from the relation between the two signals where the long-term average is above the short-term average. On corrections up, there will be some resistance from the lines at $10.35 and $12.08. A breakup above any of these levels will issue by signals. A sell signal was issued from a pivot top point on Thursday, August 3, 2023, and so far it has fallen minus 34.86%. Further fall is indicated until a new bottom pivot has been found. Volume fell together with the price during the last trading day and this reduces the overall risk as volume should follow the price movements. Here are some other signals you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, by signal. Pivots, sell signal 29 days ago. Bollinger, by signal 64 days ago. Short-term moving average, by signal 3 days ago. Long-term moving average, sell signal 22 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 19 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart we see. Short moving average, sell signal 24 days ago. The long-term moving average, buy signal 56 days ago. The relation between the short and the long moving averages. Buy signal 51 days ago. Remember to go to our page at stockinvest.us if you want to find more signals. Support, Risk, and Stop Loss for NEO NEO finds support from accumulated volume at $10.03 and this level may hold a buying opportunity as an upwards reaction can be expected when the support is being tested. This stock has average movements during the day and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. During the last day, the stock moved $0.410 between high and low, or 4.08%. For the last week, the stock has had daily average volatility of 4.09%. Before we dive into the possible good trading levels for NEO, let's quickly cover some essential fundamental data. First, the price to earnings ratio, or PE ratio. This crucial ratio measures a company's current share price relative to its per share earnings. A negative PE ratio means the company has negative earnings or is losing money. Even established companies experience down periods, often due to factors beyond their control. However, consistently negative P-E ratios may signal insufficient profit and possible bankruptcy risks. In other news, the next earnings report for Q3 2023 is expected on NOV 08, 2023. Analysts' consensus estimates are at dash $0.450. Keep an eye on these numbers, as they can greatly impact stock prices. Now let's discuss some potential day trading levels for NEO. In case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for NEO is at $10.67. If you don't own any shares, you may want to wait for this level to be breached before entering a position. For those already holding the stock, this could be a level to consider for swing trading. On the downside, NEO encounters its first support level at $10.03. If this support level holds, it could be a good entry point anticipating a rebound. We have a negative evaluation for this stock and no stop loss has been set. Is NEO stock a good buy? The NEO stock holds several negative signals and despite the positive trend, we believe NEO will perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. Therefore, we hold a negative evaluation of this stock. Due to some small weaknesses in the technical picture we have downgraded our analysis conclusion for this stock since the last evaluation from a sell to a strong sell candidate. After analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. For trading on Thursday, September 14th, we expect NEO to open up $0.130 and start trading at $10.20. We remind you that trading involves a high risk of losing money, and that you should speak with a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. You should not base your investment decision upon stockinvest.us. By using the information, you agree and are held liable for your own investment decisions. This is our current view of the stock. Do you agree or disagree? Comment below and share your thoughts. What is your target for the stock? Remember to like and subscribe. 
We wish you successful trading and have a beautiful day with regards from all of us here at Stock Invest.